Let's discuss when you have a tight neck while you're squatting. So generally what's happening is you're not uh, relaxed in some accessory breathing musculature up in your neck. Your traps here are trying to breathe in for you and they're trying to support weight for you and you're not relying on your legs. Generally, when someone is feeling a really tight neck while they're squatting, they're not feeling their legs fatiguing so much or they're doing this to avoid loading them. Now I point right here, it's in, in more specifics, it's all the quad and it's especially some hamstring too and even those glutes. So when I'm finishing a movement, I need to be able to drive my hips forward without overshooting forward and without shrugging up at all. Big way that you'll see this is in a goblet squat when you're holding weight, especially if the weight is too heavy. Let's say I can't squat my sweatshirt here and I start to curl forward a little bit, it collapses me and my shoulders shrug up because I don't have the strength to maintain good posture while I'm squatting down. So generally the back will round, the shoulders will shrug up and then you'll come back up. Now doing that afterwards, after the squat is over, you'll feel that tightness. If you're feeling this tightness, again, you need to look into the positions. So you don't need to just um, cue your shoulders down. Sometimes that's enough. Sometimes it's because there's too much weight, so you can cue, or there's too much weight and you need to choose a more appropriate weight. Um, sometimes you just need to find the position of the lower body. Now, that's kind of a good segue into one thing that I would caution you not to do. The fix here is not to shut your neck off. That never works. If I say, don't think of a purple cow, the only thing you can think of is a purple cow, right? So instead of saying, don't shut my neck off, don't shut my neck off, oh my God, it's still on. I want you to say, okay, let me find the right hip position that allows me to feel my legs moving and my muscles getting tired when I'm doing my squats. One cue that I'll give a lot of people is, okay, I want you to try to make your legs as tired as you can. Or if you feel some burning, make them burn more. Or steer into it, maybe lean into it. I want you to feel that, embrace it, get comfortable with it, it'll be over soon. Okay, so keep that in mind. Maybe you can cue yourself out of it. Maybe you're having too much weight or holding too much weight or trying to squat too much weight. This can happen in a barbell squat as well. It's the same principle. It's just really well illustrated with the goblet squat. So uh, cue too much weight and then hip position, make the legs tired.